London. We don't get many opportunities to see ships like this. Uh, it's a wonderful opportunity. Why do you think this vessel is worth noticing from your perspective? On a number of levels, it is uh, state of the art in every way, LNG, dual fuel. She's obviously now got the electric pumps uh, or electric onboard capability when she's in port. So she's a figurehead and uh, a pioneer at the moment. And there aren't many of those. Wonderful to be here to help showcase a Swedish company and Swedish uh, uh, solutions on the green trans transition. And how do you feel about what you've seen so far? Deeply impressed. Uh, I think uh, the enthusiasm that I feel here and seeing these entrepreneurs turning in a vision into reality. Because as you might know, a couple of years ago they were here talking about that, no one believed them, and here we are. So I think that is something that I really bring along with me. It's fantastic. It's a very tangible result of the progress in the regulations that we made at IMO. Very quiet, very green, very clean. And this is the image that we actually want to have for the industry. Uh, we respect noise pollution, we respect any kind of pollutions. And when you actually explore and visit a ship like this, you realize that it is possible and that we are doing it, that it's not something for the future, it's the present. It just shows what a ship can do by utilizing a fuel that's not a heavy fuel oil or a diesel fuel to reduce emissions across the board. Greenhouse gas, SOX, NOx. I think it is vitally important for shipping companies to move forward and, and educate us bureaucrats, us regulators on what we need to do and show that it can be done. It was eye-opening for me to see this. It's inspiring actually and it just makes me more committed to try to do the work we need for international shipping. Two years ago, I was invited to IMO talking about the vessel that we at that time built in uh, China and tell them what, what they will be able to do and their performance. And how do you feel about showing the results? Uh, it's, it's amazing, I will say. It's amazing. And see and how people react and uh, what they, they didn't, didn't thought that it was possible to do it this way. We want to convince the decision makers that it is possible to put on a little bit harder requirements. The industry will solve it, absolutely reduce the, the outlet and the emissions to the air. It will come in, in the end if we do the right things. <laughs>